My nightmare started like this. Eight stacks of lanterns. Just given to me? Um, so I used it to map out Camp Half-Blood. Welcome back to World Hopper Season Percy Jackson. Uh, technically, we're on month 10, so we should say Season 10, but like, it feels like Season Percy Jackson. Uh, yeah. I was hanging out with some of the members of the server who apparently have decided that villager trading is the way to go. And they had so many lanterns, and now I had so many lanterns, and I don't want to clean all this up, but it makes a really good visual for what Camp Half-Blood is going to look like. We have 12 cabins, and uh, it's going to be neat. I also need to plan, like, a big house for me to live in. <laughs> I don't want to do that yet. I'm still, I'm still living out just a bed in the wilderness, but that's fine. That, that's a not-now problem. Chaos from editing here. Uh, the next couple clips are all about me and a couple of the other server members finding the better ends, fighting the dragon, and exploring it. However, uh, apparently my mic was peaking quite a lot during that time, and I did not realize it during recording. So, sorry for the difference in audio quality. I promise I'll get it fixed. Okay, let's go. Bubbles. Okay, let's go. Okay, let's go. Where are we going? Uh, down the water. I don't know. Down the water. Get in the water. the water. Everyone get in the water. Yeah. Ah. Ah. Zombies, get in the water. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> They're going. <laughs> They're going. <laughs> They're going. Where are we going? Well, that way. We're going all the way down, but I was gonna die, so you know. Okay. Okay, I Whoa. need to set up the music. I need to I... set up the music. The music, the music. Oh, and light the lights. Yeah. Some of us have eternal night vision, so we don't get that. Oh, we all. Who has, who has the eyes to actually open the things? It's definitely not me. Did anyone get them? Did anyone bring it? <laughs> not again! Guys, we can smell them. Come on. Thank you, Millette. Everyone gather around. <laughs> On three, two, one. Duh. Ah! <laughs> Everyone careful. Oh my god. Oh, goodness. Oh, oh, this looks so cool. I love I this. Let's run. Oh, let's sweet. run. Yeah, let's oh. time. Oh, oh, go oh no. <laughs> oh no. Oh, come on. Oh, oh, I should have brought bottles. I only got a sword, you guys. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah. I'll be useful when it comes down here eventually. Uh, one of these days, you know, five <laughs> days <laughs> Oh, hey, Bell. A uh, Bell. Oh, incoming! Oh, here it comes. Ah! Oh! You know, just cash. No, it's not. Why is that a different color? Morning. Who's firing lightning bolts? Damn. Uh, inspiration! Victory! I believe there's still literally end crystals, you guys. Yeah. It's okay, I got one. Uh, I'm... Oh, it's what? Oh, it's the dragon. No, I just got hit by a ship with a Why are there blaze rods in here now? Who brought blaze rods? Oh, help. Guys, I'm stuck in the hole. Well, for me. Ow. Ow. 
I'm in the hole again. <laughs> I love this. This is like I'm actually like enjoying myself so much. It's I love this. Is this. this is enrichment. I, uh, yeah, I love this. Can we just have better ends all the time? Oh god, it's a little bit. You want to know why the server's been crashing? I, I do know why it's been crashing. Chaos. I want. I use this mod, and two mallets kept me in four. But it's so pretty. I'm just gonna start putting out fires. Oh, leave me alone, you. Oh, great. Not if we kill it fast enough. Ow! Oh god. Oh god. Oh no. Oh no. Well. Time flows. Only we know. Wait! What? I hit the wrong button, sorry. <laughs> I have four. Does anyone see my grave? Oh god. Oh, I need that Wait. Wait, where did you die at? Wait, I don't know. Oh, god. <laughs> A lot of things were happening. Oh, yeah. I found my corpse, don't worry. Oh no. You found your corpse? But also, ow, my face. Yeah. All right, I had to step away for a little bit, take a bit of a break, which means we're going to be end busting alone in Better Ends, which is modded and terrifying. Let's do this! I'm like scared to get through this portal. I don't think I've ever had that feeling before. It's literally the void, but magic on the other side. Should I hold my sword? I'm gonna hold my sword while I go through. Okay, I guess that's what we're dealing with. I don't know what these oh things are. Can I can I have them? But if I break them, will I be able to get down and around? Oh, they don't have the pretty red texture. That's sad. I, I want the beans. We have the beans. What else is here? Pretty. Oh, oh, I need silk touch for that. Oh. I also need silk touch for that. Okay, I'm gonna come back here with silk touch and a pair of shears. Oh my god. Yeah, no, I need I need these. I I I I need all of these. Can I just move to the better end? So we got normal textury wood, and we got aggressive pink planks. Feels like this could be used for the Aphrodite cabin. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'm grabbing a few of these. Alright, let's explore some more. I, I feel like there's a lot more biomes, like this pretty blue one that I immediately want. <gasps> it's foggy land? Yes, please. Wait, but I want the flowers. Wait, but I want the flowers. Okay, welcome to the Hades cabin. <gasps> welcome to the Iris cabin. Oh. Oh, the aesthetic of these next to each other. Immediately is my everything. My backpacks are very much getting full at this, but uh, these are really pretty wood type. Look at this. That, I'm not sure how well I can use that, but it's definitely going to be used for something. And these... I need to go get some silk touch, but I'm definitely bringing them back. I'll be back, beautiful and If nothing else, I'll need a silk touch book to visit you. Or maybe a pair of shears. Ow. 
Okay, now let's actually get to work with building camp half blood. I've added signs behind me to uh, indicate which cabin is going where. I found a map of just like the basic layout of Camp Half Blood. I only kept the names of the people who we have origins for, so Hera is not going to be included because there's no children of Hera here. Otherwise, let's get building. I need help figuring out what the heck to do for the Poseidon house, you know? Blocks. I do. Well, I have blocks. Mm, mm -hmm. I feel like prismarine would be the wrong type of blue, and the texture would be off. Well, I mean, prismarine changes color. Yeah, but none of the colors are the right color of blue. Uh, er, yeah. er, I, only, I keep saying Hermes. It's Hermes. There's an H in that word uh, over yeah, here. Yeah, there is H. Uh-huh. I'm gonna let, I know you were this guy, but then you were summoning lightning bolts with skeletons, so I have a feeling you might have changed. Oh, that's the Hades axe. Oh, no, it's it. Oh, wait, Chaos, where's a good clearing I can show you? Okay, hold on, I can show you Poseidon's trident. How much of a clearing do you need? I can get down on the ground for you, yeah? Okay, right. Ready. Oh, where's the hole? Yeah, I don't- can it not break the snow? Oh, I should not break the snow. Oh, oh wow, that- you, you broke part of my house, my dude. Whee! Wait, Fair why enough. is this covered in cobwebs? Oh, that's uh, just the type of cave. Oh, someone lives down here. No. No. No one lives there. True. Pretty sure. Pretty, pretty no. sure. <laughs> pretty sure there's a basement dweller. Oh, can you enter Sap's basement from here? Yeah. Yeah, you oh. can. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh. Skip. Yeah. Okay, where's where's the thing? The, oh, the waystone's up here. Good night. Good night. I went to, I oh I'm very much in the wrong place. This is not yeah, my boy. village. Where did you go? <laughs> Somewhere incorrect. Alright. Wait, where is my have I been deleted? There I am. Never mind. Okay. Now goodbye. <laughs> goodbye. Alright, I'm gonna be honest, I'm really stuck. I don't- I don't know what to do for the rest of them. I got flooring down. I, I did that much and might have also burned down a tree by mistake, but doors and roofs and all the things we all know I can't handle. It's once again stopping me. I think it's an inspiration thing. Like, I want all of them to feel unique and different, but we're kind of running out of things that feel unique and different. I have Hades with some dragon bones blocks, because, you know, bones... And they're also purple, and that was, like, a neat aesthetic. And then over here, we have Hermes, which, like, I don't know, this color just felt like Hermes to me. And then we have Hephaestus, which, like, I really did not want anything in their building to be flammable, considering uh, children of Hephaestus can summon lava, as you do. And then we have Apollo, and I just, I kind of, I'm going to be like, I kind of give up. I started a pattern, and then I realized the pattern wouldn't work, and I tried modifying the pattern, and that pattern wouldn't work, it's whatever. Uh, I really like what I have so far. I'm just struggling. 
and we're running out of time, so I can't be struggling for too much longer. This world is ending, as all worlds do. I think we really just need to put our head down and look through our chests and see what type of building material we have left. Because we have all of this that we really haven't used yet. Who who gets the dragon head? I feel I feel like I feel like the Hades cabin's gonna get the dragon head. No wait, but the Argo no, we don't care about the Argo crew right now. The Hades cabin's just gonna get a dragon head. Oh, wait, I put that down wrong. There. there. The Hades cabin is done. I kid. I'll build the rest of them now, I guess. And we're done. Well, okay. You know, some of these are not my best work. And I I very much do not like some of them. But, but others, you know, you can tell I built it. You mostly can tell I built the Ares cabin. Just, if you open up the inside, you go, oh, yeah, nope, that's a chaos. <laughs> but the rest of these, uh, you know, we we have we have the 12 cabins. Actually, I was talking to Millette. No one ever rolled a Poseidon Origin. So even though it was an option to get, we don't have anyone who would ever be in this cabin. We, you know, big three conversations, but there's like three Hades, so whatever. Uh, you know, I did do inside uh, interior for a few of these. They're not great, but we do have hammocks over here, so, you know. Also, apparently all the chairs uh, just capture mobs, so don't go, don't go into the Athena cabin, because there's some dangerous things in there. You know what, let's do a tour. First of all, we have the Artemis cabin. I was, I was really feeling like the dark, spooky night hunter vibes. If I had time and cared enough i would have decorated with this with like greenery and foliage and have like a green ceiling i'm tired of running out of time uh aphrodite the floor is soap the floor is soap the i i'm gonna be real i had to ask how to get this i had no clue how to get this block but i saw it and i went mm, i want it uh if i can get out of this door thank you i've trapped myself inside dionysus i very much wanted it to feel like you're walking into the cabin defined by insanity and, you know, I think I did a good job. Also, there's no, there's no way, at least, the people are going to end up on the floor somewhere or another. Give them sleeping bags, come on. I already showed off the Hades cabin. Uh, da, da, da. I gotta show off the Hermes cabin. This one needed to feel really crowded because not only Hermes uh, is going to have a lot of kids, it's also the cabin for all the unclaimed kids. It's the protection of the travelers. Now, Hephaestus, it's very plain, very simple. Didn't really do interior, but I knew I wanted beds off the grounds at least a little bit because of lava flow. I really should have put chests in here or chairs. I I ran out of energy, you guys. We're running out of time. Uh, Apollo, tight quarters, but with hammocks, kind of cozy, orange and yellow vibes. Uh, we already showed off that one. We already showed off... Ooh, the Zeus cabin. I want it to actually feel like, you know, Greco-Roman inspired. Only one big bed. It felt fitting. Um... I feel like we have only one person who has a Zeus origin. I don't remember. This is uh, Demeter. You know, we, we have some of the petal blocks in here. I didn't really clean up the snow too much. Um, took me a while to get roofs on things, okay? I, I don't I don't like roofs. I was going for a cottagecore vibe. Again, I ran out of effort to detail things. It's dangerous to go in the Athena cabin. Um... But I very much wanted it to feel like modern industrial buildings, which y'all know I'm not a fan of, but I mean, there's a place. I already showed off that one. Which one haven't I showed off yet? Oh, wait, I think we actually got all of them. Oh, the campfire. One of my favorite fun facts is that for a very long time, Dionysus was not an Olympian. For a very long time, that 12th Olympian spot was Hestia, the goddess of the hearth. And in the Percy Jackson books, that's kind of a big deal. She's kind of a major plot point in the last Olympian books. So we got to have a giant campfire in the middle of Camp Half-Blood. No, I didn't get around to building the big house, but I built 12 houses, you guys. I'm a little tired. So while I sit here by the fire and warm up, um, well, that's going to hang out with us too. <laughs> Hi. Hi, Millette. I was just trying to do my outro, but do you like, do you like Camp Half-Blood? Do you like it? I put moves on things. I was dying the whole time. Campfire, yeah, yeah, this is Hestia. For the, the, because, you know, Hestia wouldn't have any kids, and we don't have an origin for her, but she's the goddess of the hearth and stuff. 
kind of a big plot point. I was explaining it all to, to the to the viewers. You'll, you, you'll understand in about two days. Well, I'm tired. And I think I'm sick. So. Good night. Also, take Cat's head off. <laughs> take. You're wearing Cat's head again. Take it off. Oh, 